Matt Duffy, everybody. How are you, Matty? I'm good. Can you please tell us what exactly this day entails? Uh, yeah, so we're up early this morning. Um, had a few radio interviews and then I went on live breakfast TV, which is a bit nerve-wracking. But, um, yeah, it's all just about launching the season and, um, yeah, I guess how exciting it's going to be. We've got 10 guys here from all over the country, so it's great, yeah. That's a big day because it's only 10 o'clock already, so what time did you get up? I got up at 5.30. Um, yeah, I was in here by sort of... Yeah, quarter past six. Um, had a bit of a deep uh, brief, and then yeah, and then just straight over to NZME. Um, so on Radio Sport, Flavor. Unfortunately, I had to sing on Flavor. Did then, you? Yeah, I um I didn't realise what we we're doing, and then they were just like, oh, just pick a song, and I just picked the Westlife song because I was like, oh yeah, that'd be kind of funny, and then they're like, okay, you're gonna sing it, and I was like, I've apologised to all the viewers, oh, the, the the listeners for that. They're driving in, probably thinking, oh, what is he up to? So, um, no, nah, it's been an interesting morning. Do you get nervous going on the radio or TV? Because you predominantly you play rugby for a job. Oh, it is a bit outside the comfort zone, but I think the live breakfast was also a little bit nervous for that. Um, it was good having Geordie Barrett with me. And I think we are both like, oh, let's not stuff this up because it's live. So there's 10 of you have gathered for this. What, how often do you guys get together like this? Um, yeah, only really like, you know, in a commercial window when we do, you know, um, promotions together for you know the sponsors for New Zealand rugby and stuff they get a few guys together but yeah it's the first time we've all sort of been none of us have done this before like the Super Rugby launch so um, yeah I think it's all new for us and yeah it's a cool learning experience so, yeah. And what's it like filming the commercial? And that was pretty cool it was like um, probably the biggest sort of set I've been on um, it was like uh, you know explosions there's motorbikes in the background and there was a camera going super fast across the set and stuff so it was yeah it was a big day it was all day so it was pretty cool though yeah pretty enjoyable stuff you know like don't really get to do that stuff very often so yeah it's cool so when the camera came across we were supposed to kick kick a ball and Jerome threw a ball and there was a guy one of the producers was standing there facing the other way looking at the camera and it hit him straight on the head that was quite funny but it won't get Put on the TV over. No, that one. Yeah, there's a lot of expensive equipment. And we're just throwing footies like outside of the thing, and there was guys running around trying to catch them. So yeah, it was good. And so you're all mixing and mingling here today as great mates. Do you do you get to have a chance to have a beer with each other after the games, or you just stick to your team? No, yeah, we normally sort of catch up. I think um, the old tradition of going into the um, opposition change room is still alive today, which is good. Let's, yeah, I guess it's the essence of why we play rugby. Um, quite often guys have come through the system together and, you know, you have mates and you've got guys you meet and, you know, at days like this you can catch up with. And while we're on the field, we're pretty, you know, I guess don't really like each other. But then once the whistle goes, it's like, oh, whatever's happened, happened. And we just go have a beer and sort of talk about footy and talk about life and stuff. So, yeah. Awesome, thank you so much Matty for your time and all the best for the season. Thank you very much, thanks for having me.